This is um. Well, I'm gonna say all praise on going to Yahweh. Bashim Yahshua, Bashim Yahshua does double honors, seek the elder of apostles, great millstone. And so he says, I can teach all truth and sincerity. Um, basically, only a remnant of Israel shall return. Um, so I'm going to read um, Jeremiah 31 and 7. It says, For thus saith Yahweh sings with uh, gladness for Jacob and shout among the chief of the nations, publish ye, praise ye, and say, O Yahweh, save thy people, the remnant of Jacob. Um, because only a remnant of Jacob shall return unto Yahweh Shai and serve Yahweh Shai with truth and sincerity. Um, I'm gonna go to uh, Isaiah chapter 10, verse 20. Uh, it's Isaiah 10, 20, and it shall come to pass. In that day that the remnant of Israel, such as are escaped the house of Jacob, shall no more again stay upon him that smote them, but shall stay upon Yahweh, the Holy One of Israel, in truth. Um, so we're not going to stay upon, uh, you know, Esau and the other nations, which smote us. We're going to stay upon our power, Yahweh Bashim you know, you know, the Holy One of Israel, in truth. Uh, it says, verse 21, the remnant shall return even to the rem Lockyer. The remnant shall return even the remnant of Jacob unto the mighty power. Um, for, for thou, Lockyer, for though thy people Israel be as the sand of the sea, yet a remnant of them shall return. The consumption decree shall overflow with righteousness. So, the remnant, you know, the um, the 144,000 and one third shall um return to the Lord and shall um basically be the you know delivered well willing in the end. Um, I'm read uh Micah chapter five verse seven. Um, this is a uh, Micah 5 verse 7 says, And the remnant of Jacob shall be in the midst of many people as a dew from Yahweh, as the, the showers upon the grass that tareth not for men, nor waited for the sons of men. And, um, you know, the Israel is as the sand and sea. We're, we're amongst all nations, um, all over the four corners of the earth, you know, amongst all. Uh, 17 heathen nations, you know, um, <coughs> excuse me, um, it says verse 8, and the remnant of Jacob shall be among the Gentiles in the midst of many people as a lion among the beasts of the forest, as a young lion among the flock of sheep, oh, if he go through both tread it down and tear it in pieces and none can deliver it. So we're heavenly amongst these heathens, um, hidden in plain sight. Um and uh a remnant of 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 Jacob amongst these heathens and amongst the so called Negroes, Latinos and Americans are gonna return to Yahweh and um follow after him in truth and sincerity. Uh Faithfully, uh, I'm read verse nine. Thy hand shall be lifted upon thy adversaries, and all thy enemies shall be cut off. So we're gonna put our hands upon you heathens and cut you asunder out, out of your rulership, and cut you down and and uh, dash you dash your little ones, uh, to pieces in 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 the near future. Uh, verse ten. Uh, and it shall come to pass in that day. Say Yahweh that I will cut off thy horses out of the midst of thee, and I will destroy thy chariots. And we're gonna um, you know, cut you out of your power seat, but literally also we're gonna cut down your uh your vehicles that you uh ride in your your chariots that you we're gonna bring those down. Also, 
those things that you uh uh you know frequently ride in too um it says verse 11 i will cut the cities of thy land and throw down all thy strongholds um basically all your um your cities your land and your 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 governments uh shall be cut down um it says verse 12 i will cut off witchcraft out of thy hands and thou shalt have no more soothsayers so all your witchcraft and all your soothsayers will be cut you know completely destroyed you know you know all you heathens that uh what's the word do, do witchcraft against the children of israel all that's gonna be done away with um i'm gonna go to uh romans romans uh Romans nine twenty six. Uh, this is Romans nine twenty six. It says, "And it shall come to pass that in the place where it was said unto them, Ye are not my people, there shall they be called the, the children of the living power." And um, it said over over here on the Western Hemisphere, you know, it said that we're um we're not the people of the Lord. But you know, like it says in um Zephaniah, uh, I believe chapter three, it says, um, we shall be given fame in every land we were put to shame. You know, um the the truth of uh, uh, the Hebrew Israelites are getting um recognized more and more every day. As as the as the the approach of Yahweh Shah's return, um, you know, is uh you know, getting nearer and nearer. Um, but um I'm gonna go to verse twenty seven, it says Isaiah also cried concerning Israel, though the number of the children of Israel be as the sand of the sea, a remnant shall be saved. So that remnant is uh the the elect of the nation of Israel in the one third, they're gonna be saved, delivered into the to the uh chariots and receive the kingdom on the first go around. It says verse twenty eight, for he will finish the work and cut it short in righteousness, because a short work will Yahweh make upon the earth. And um I talked about that in Matthew, uh how uh it's Matthew twenty four and and twenty two. It says, "And and except those days be shortened, there should no flesh be saved. But for the elect's sake, those shape those days shall be shortened." So Yahweh, Bashim Yahshah, he's shortening the days for the elect's sake. You know, um, and he's going to um, basically work. In 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 a short time, he's gonna speedily speed, um, the deliverance and 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 the uh, um of of his of his of the remnant of Israel. Um, uh, I'm gonna go to Acts. Uh, thirteen verse forty one. Uh, this is Acts thirteen verse forty one. It says. Uh, behold, ye despisers and wander, and perish. For I work a work in your days, a work which ye shall in no wise believe, though a man declare it unto you. So, you know Yahweh Bashim Yahshai, he's gonna work, um, work in in our days. In this time, we shall see the deliverance of, of his 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 his. his 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 remnant, the elect, the one third of the nation of Israel. Um. Uh, I'm going to Daniel. Uh, twelve. Daniel. Daniel twelve and ten. Daniel twelve and ten. It says, "Many shall be purified and made white and tried, but the wicked shall do wickedly, and none of the wicked shall understand." the wise should understand so if you have um 
if you don't believe that Yahweh Sin Yah Shah is not gonna uh speedily speed this this uh speedily speed up and save his his and deliver his remnant, um, you know, and you you don't understand that, you know, Yahweh Sin Yah Shah is shortening the days for the elect's sake and you know then um uh, you know you don't uh you know you you don't you you know you don't um what's the word you you don't understand no do you um nor are you uh what's the word uh basically you don't have full understanding of 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 uh, the ways of, of the Lord and how he how he said he's gonna make it short and um he's gonna make it short only only the wise you know the uh the wise individuals will understand that the days of you know of Yahweh and Yahshua he's he's shortening days because right now we're we're in the month of May you know and it, you know this; these months have flown by. You know we were once in January, and now we're in May. Um, that's how that's how uh, speeding. That's how uh, what's the word? That's how fast Yahweh Shem Yah Shai is speeding the days up. You know. Uh, I'm gonna read uh, Jeremiah. Jeremiah uh six verse sixteen. Um it says this Jeremiah six verse sixteen it says, Thus saith Yahweh, uh stand ye in the way and see and ask for the old path, where's the good way? Walk therein, and ye shall find rest for your souls. But they said we will not walk therein. And um the wicked two thirds of our people, they don't have any understanding. Um, we could show them the the right way, but they'll they'll continue walking in the wickedness and um uh never want to uh turn back to Yahweh and Yahshua and repent for all their their wicked ways. But um uh basically, like it says in uh, Job eight and eight, I inquire you, I pray thee. Of the former age to search for your fathers, you know, looking back at like it says in Romans fifteen and four, look at the generation of old. Uh, um, it says Romans fifteen and four says, um, everything was uh, swaggy. Let me get it right quick. It's Romans. I I don't want to butcher that one. This is Romans fifteen and four. It says. For whatsoever things were written aforetime were written for our learning, that we through patience and comfort of the scriptures might have hope. Us looking at the old paths of our 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 righteous forefathers and foremothers, you know, we look at the way they they walk with Yahweh and Yahshai, and they're great examples to look at on how to walk with Yahweh and Yahshai the right way, and um, to lead to the kingdom, you know. So, I'm going to end it right here. I'm going to say all praise and glory to Yahweh, Bashim Yahshai, Bashim Kakadash, Jawan, the Elder, Apostles, Great Millstone, Sajay, T. Rock, and Peace, all truth is said in the trouble.